This one's called Dark Changes the Locksmith. Give it a try. It popped on to IndieDB this week. It's supposed to be a relatively short a five minute ish game. And we'll see. Oh my gosh, that was way too loud. That's really messed up. So Gitta is my profile name on this computer. I'm going to hate this game already. Oh. Okay. Wow, I'm blown away. Uh, it pulled my username. Wow. This looks really trippy. I'm like smiling. But my heart is going way too, way too fast right now. <laughs> it's midday here in Georgia. Am I going straight into this? Okay, shake it off. Man, I hate hallway games. I don't like games that exist strictly just to freak you out. Oh, this is going to be one of those games. Oh, the sound. the sounds are so good. I want to drink my water, but I don't know if I want to be freaked out about it. Oh, I can sprint. I forgot. Get out of me. I'm not in you. You're in my head, if anything. Hmm. I think I'm on the same track as last time. Gotta be a puzzle. I'm I'm doing it wrong. You gonna reboot me to the same thing? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Can't get this way. So most games that I play, I don't know. It's only two on the channel at this point. Uh, I'm talking throughout them, but this one just has me like wrapped up into it immediately. And I don't know if I want to go. I don't know if I want to go straight there. Hmm. Yeah, probably. And as I play them, I'll get feedback on them. This one's just messed up immediately. I don't mean that in a bad way. Like, it's good. It's good. I like it. But I am super confused. Um... Get out of me. Are clues in the lights or how to make this puzzle not not appear? This is kind of strange. Let's walk backwards. Nah, it didn't help. Alright, we'll figure it out. We'll get it. My dog is on the floor playing with a squeaker toy. I really hope he doesn't start jamming on the squeaker. I go back to the other area I was at? Or just run into this wall or... Nah, I really am trapped. Okay. Such a good job on the lights. If this was a game that was more like open world where a lot of ambient lighting was important, I would say it needs some work, but for the purposes of the game where it's meant to scare you, you just have a lot of black and white and shades of gray. A lot of absolute light or no light does its job well. I don't know what to do here. I'm hearing some really funky noises though. Really funky noises. Oh, it let me go. Uh, I kind of had peace before knowing what was to come and now it's back into the wild light. <laughs> Don't know what's gonna happen. Arlo, leave your toy alone. <laughs> it's 
So what did I do that time to change how the game played? So let me go through the hallway, but I, I took it really slow. Let me just hit it full on running. Oop, my character got tired. We'll walk there. That must have been me. Okay. I think I'll save my run and I'll run through the hallway and see if that triggers it. If not, what I did before was I paused here on the corner. I heard some funky sounds. And once I heard them, I went, here's me running. Okay. But it was accompanied by the sound though, too. Sound of like, I don't know how to explain it. Dang it. I'm going to pause at the corner until I hear that sound. I don't hear it. There it is. Okay. Am I good? No. What's the pattern? What is the pattern here? Maybe it is from here. Well then, I'm gonna run through it. Didn't I already try to run through it and it didn't work? All right, here comes the run. Here we go. Uh, I guess frightening and enjoyable, but it's getting frustrating too. <laughs> You know, when it gets frustrating, it gets less enjoyable, and then you want to turn it off to at a point, right? Uh, so let's keep trying to figure this out. Or do I just wait for 10 seconds and then go? Interesting uh, lighting there. You can see that. Goes from blue back to clear. All right, that was 10 seconds. Wait, I might, I might, I might have it. Let's go at this again. So I think the key is to stay near the light. So there's light on the left side of the hallway. If I hug that side, will it let me through? Yes. Or was it because I'm running? I'm not sure. So now I'm going to go this way. Kind of stay right in the middle. I think this is it, guys. It's going to freak me out. Okay. Oh, it's coming. I know the scare is coming. No. Uh, I'm going back to the beginning. Yeah? Yeah, it says. Shoot. Hmm, what can I do different? My heart rate's 85. I think it's more 85. Okay, hug the wall. Hug the wall. Good. This side. Mill. That didn't work. Is it randomized? Well, the developer said it should be a five-ish minutes. If it's randomized, it could take more than five minutes for the, the correct sequence to play through for the player. Maybe I just didn't do it right because hugging the wall seems to work. Here we go. This way, right in the wall, right in the light, I mean, right in the light, right in the light, come on, straight ahead. 
I noticed the one light there. So I hug the corner here. Then it's dark. It's dark all the way through over here. Dang it. <laughs> Talk's going crazy. And he has a squeaker toy. Oh, buddy. Uh, I'll give it a few more chances. See if we can bust this code. to look up. <laughs> Cracks in the ceiling. The ceiling has me go right, the floor has me go more towards the left. Do I have to look at the ceiling and not the not the floor? Because the floor is getting an angled shadow from the ceiling above. Why is that shadow flickering? Okay. Anyway, let's hit this light. Hit the light, right underneath the light. Is there a spot where I'm supposed to turn around, like right where I hit that square? I notice the light shift behind me. Am I supposed to go back the way I came and the, the layout changes then? So the biggest wow factor of this game probably wasn't too hard to do, but it was pulling my username. Uh, that was just cool. That was great. Okay. Let's explore the corners of this room. Will the guy come out if I walk in the darkness here? And that doesn't appear to be. Well, let's go back the way we came again. This doesn't feel right, though. So there was a game. It's probably like. Eight years old at this point, some some SCP game where you had to walk in a hallway down a staircase and try to get out. I saw something there for a second. Um, I never played that one because I can't take the the close spaces of these hallway games. Pause. What am I gonna do? What do I do? I will hug a side of that wall like I did, uh, like what I do at the end of this hall here. I'd like to defeat this. Or is it like after 20 tries, the biggest jump scare of your life just comes out and makes you never want to play again? Alright, let's hug the right side, right side, right side, right side, right side, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, I'm gonna go straight. <sighs> I take a breather now because I'm in unknown territory. Okay, light again, go to the light, go to the light. Very good, very good. Hug a wall, hug a wall. <laughs> Games are my weakness. I guess I got a lot of weaknesses. Ah, oh, I'm not out yet. <sighs> That's gotta be the right way. It's gotta be the right way.
So I'm on the right side of the wall. Oops. And this thing's on the right corner. Is it trying to tell me to stay on the right side at this point in time? This one's just doing circles every direction. Uh, I could try to go left. That just looks pitch black. Yeah, it's not the right way. This game will take 5 minutes, 15 minutes later. So earlier on I made a note about uh, the lighting here and how it's so black and white. There's not a whole lot of like gray in between so to speak. Not a whole lot of differentiation between solid blacks or solid whites. But that's also the point of the game. Because the light is what guides you through. So you want to be able to see that white when it comes up. And we're gonna go right. Don't come out, don't come out. There's this little opening there. Should I do it for science? It's not right though, if the light's over here. I really don't think that would be correct. Left. Okay, right, that's darkness for sure. So is this. Are these both wrong? No, okay, right was correct. Oh my gosh. See me. Feels like I'm watching the, the rain. You are the best. <laughs> Um, are we done? Please be it. Please be it. That's it. And it opens an image with my name on it. Man, that's cool. My dog is a zoomies. He's going crazy right now. Do you guys want to see this right now? I mean, he's just... It's alright, bud. Sell down. <laughs> anyway, back to this. Um, that's just cool. That's just cool. Uh, maybe a little creepy, uh, but I think it's all, all in good fun to get the uh, the name change. It's over here. Um, let's pull this back up. I like the fact that in the beginning there was this really trippy white sequence here. I wish there was more of that, but it's fine. The game has to progress into something else, and that something else just so happened to be the maze portion. Um, yeah, I don't really know what to say. It was fun. It was entertaining. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of dumbfounded on what to say. All in all, it's just a good time. Uh, enjoyable game. You did a great job on it. Uh, well, I kind of want to go back and play again for the first time, but I know how to beat it. <sighs> but yeah, guys, that's it. So have a great day. Enjoy your Memorial Day, and I'll see you next time.